All right, so let me preface this by saying I really like decorating for Thanksgiving and fall. So I had a lot of pumpkin seeds. I've procured a little bit of land to be able to grow all these. These are not growing at my garden. So let's start with this one. Got an order from Blue Pumpkin. I found this on Etsy. All right. So. I have pumpkins and squash. Lakota squash. Let's see. Mint Prince pumpkin. So these are all just different colored pumpkins, different shapes of pumpkins. Dark Knight, that looks pretty cool. Oh, you guys can't really see that though, can you? Okay. Oh, there's more mint prints. I must have doubled up that one. Speckled Hound. This one's a fun one because it's got like the two colors to it. Charisma Pumpkin. It looks like a regular pumpkin. One too many. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's a, a pink pumpkin. Jack B. Little. Gooligan. And Hooligan. These are three small pumpkin varieties. <clears throat> Black Fruit too. I don't even remember what half of these were. Long Island cheese, this is a really good eating pumpkin. Really meaty, has a like pinky color to it. Kizuna has a nice shape there. Can you see that? Snowball, you got your white pumpkin there. So, awesome. We got some tags, so. Tons of pumpkins, tons and tons of pumpkins. And again, that's from Blue Pumpkin on Etsy. Uh, I don't even know what's in these. I've been ordering seeds for a few months now. So I don't even know what each of these packets are. Oh, more pumpkin seeds, okay, good. So let's see, Turks Turban Squash, Aries Pumpkin, and I don't have pictures of these, so Silver Edge, look at the seeds on those, they're like gray, really neat. White Boar, this is your uh, stacking pumpkin, the white stacker. Uh, Autumn Crown Pumpkin, Daybreak, Blue Doll, Porcelain Doll, and, oh, more day breaks. Okay, so, yeah, look at this. Pumpkins and squash. Awesome. That's going to be a lot of fun. Oh, more pumpkins. Okay. <laughs> I told you I got a lot. I told you I got a lot. I'm, I might have gone a little crazy this year on pumpkins. Let's see, here's a winter squash, honey nut winter squash. Oh, I didn't even know I ordered this. I hope I didn't order it again. Uh, uh, acorn squash. Kusha squash, Kusha gourd. Sweet meat. This is supposed to be a really good eating squash. I'm kind of excited to see how this turns out. Rogue Vital. This might be a red pumpkin. Another winter squash. Another acorn squash. And blue Hubbards. We really like the Hubbards here. Uh, I have a bunch of them frozen and cooked in the basement. Really nice squash. Look at that. Look at that. So, so many. Okay, now this is Southern Seed Exchange. I also found this on uh, Etsy. I think most of my squashes came from Etsy as well. These are my Cardoon and artichoke seeds. I got a couple packs of each. I wanna try 
growing cardoons. I've never had cardoon. I've never grown cardoon. I have grown artichoke before. It doesn't survive the winters here generally, but we've been having more mild winters lately, so I'm going to try it out. And I also want to try these out in the landscaping because they are a really awesome foliage plant. Uh, big flowers uh, if you don't eat them first. So I'm really excited about these, but I got to get these started soon. Okay, this is another Etsy shop store. Let's see. So I got some lettuces, uh, zucchini. I got a white zucchini. I thought that was kind of cool. Uh, white wonder cucumber. We like the white cucumbers. They're really easy to find on the vines. And they're usually really sweet. And uh, those are nice. More lettuces. We really like to grow lettuces here. We got a couple different kinds. Lola Rosa is really good. It's really bright red. Uh, really nice looking lettuce. Really mild flavor. Uh, let's see. Shiso. I've grown this once before. Uh, it doesn't grow too well for me, but the leaves are kind of minty and citrusy. Really interesting. I want to play around with this. Uh, zucchini. Miner's lettuce and corn salad. Uh, this is native to like California area. Uh, I've never had it before. I hear it's really good, really, uh, really sweet and mild. And bitter melon. Uh oh. Ooh, I, I picked up some other bitter melon too. Oh, this will be this will be fun. Okay. <laughs> See, this is the problem. You uh, you order all these seeds earlier in the year and you forget what you get. And then this is my Baker Creek order. So again, we uh, we got more lettuce. I I'm not a big fan of iceberg, but this is a small variety. I thought it would be really fun to try growing it. My free seed, uh, uh, purple mis uh, mizuna. Excuse me. Um, I had these seeds already. <laughs> I got I got them a couple years ago. Fun plant to grow. Gets really big. And I got my peppers. I got a few different kinds. Kajari melon. I've heard so much about this. People really like this one. It's a smaller melon. Um, I'm going to try this on a trellis with my uh, bitter melon. And with my, um, I think I got another bitter melon in here. Let's see if I can find it. Oh yeah, right there. I got the white bitter melon too. Never had bitter melon before. Never grew bitter melon before. I really want to try this. Um, Moringa is a edible tree, basically. Uh, I have heard the leaves are high in protein and the seed pods can be eaten and the roots are edible. So I want to try this out. It's not going to be able to survive our winters here, but I think it'd make a, an okay houseplant. Maybe I'll take it and uh, put it in my office at work. It'll be easy to, to store it at least. Uh, more lettuce. I really like colored lettuces. So this one is like a creamy, yellowy white with the red splotches on it. Really pretty. I'm really excited to see how that goes. These are all mixed up. Uh, this is another, I think this is like a butter butterhead lettuce. Um, again, we eat a lot of lettuces in the spring. Uh, tomatillo. I got this because it was purple. I liked the color. I thought it was neat. Maybe we'll make some salsa. And a couple. Let's see if I can find the other. I thought I had another tomato. But uh, so this one, again, different color. Black strawberry tomato. I needed some more cherry tomato type tomatoes because uh, we eat those quite a bit. I love snacking on these in the summer. So here's another pepper. I kind of picked a bunch of peppers with the same color because I wanted to try to make 
a light colored hot sauce. I thought that would be kind of fun. So we got the peach buchalokia. We have the sugar rush peach. I have, oh, grab the wrong one, sugar rush cream. So these are all gonna be uh, good flavored peppers. And I also got the lemon drop pepper, which I think is a really awesome color and it has supposedly a citrusy flavor to it. Uh, here's another freebie. We got some cucumbers, so that's nice. And I also picked up quinoa. Uh, I've always wanted to try growing quinoa. I thought it would be just a fun little thing to try out. So yeah, nice, nice seed haul. I uh, definitely don't have enough room for all of this stuff in my gardens, but you know, we all get a little crazy, right? We all get a little crazy.